freaking there it is. Oh, I'm losing my freaking mind. Maybe get this thing on the little pick me jiggy. Alright. Oh. Gotta try to make this quick. Getting a headache. Morning, James, Brian, Dale. Happy Easter tomorrow. Mostly Mabuna. Morning, Vaughn.
Oh, what up, all? I don't have me an energy drink. I don't think I got any here. Yeah, I do. I always, I always have backup. I always need backup with everything. Not the bangs, but I got a. Uh, Aha. Uh -huh. Whatever this is. It has caffeine. I need caffeine. Or I go on a killing spree. <laughs> oh, I think I'm getting a headache. I'm already tired before I'm tired. Stressed. Anyway, let me. Cold this morning. It's uh, weather sucks here in Ohio, Cleveland, up north here. Rain. Yeah, I just seen this morning in the news. We got more snow showers coming in later in the week. It's like, come on. Uh, I need some vitamin D, sunshine. At least 50 degrees, 60. Oh. Anywho, um, uh, we did get some things new Thursday, <laughs> early morning, and sold a bunch of stuff yesterday, matter of fact. Um, we got some rid of some fish that's been sitting here for a bit. One guy came in, he's like, I couldn't believe I had them. He knew what they were, and to ship them in would have cost them double. Um, so I was about to take those Bartonis to the hatcheries and throw them in a big tank and grow them out. They're really cool fish. Um, and their breeding dress is when they're amazing. They're literally half black, half white, the male and the female. So they're on the rare side. Um, what else? All right, let's go look around. I do have, let me see. Uh, let's go, it's got more fish coming Tuesday. I really don't have room for more fish. I know people just don't know the business, don't understand, but it's crazy. Jumbo John, good morning. People keep asking for stuff that we don't have. Please buy what we have. Quit asking for more stuff. It's like, I gotta sell stuff, make money and buy more stuff, but we also need the tanks empty to get more stuff in. Real estate is at a premium. That's dry goods also. That's why I'm trying to get rid of a bunch of dry goods. That's why I got the clearance sale. I got stuff cheap over there. We'll go over that, like the flex kits. Uh, yeah, they're cheaper than the internet. I'm, I'm not really making a whole lot of money. I, I just want the money out of it to use for paying bills and other inventory um, that's like selling. Right now, certain things are just not moving. People are not buying certain things, and not like they used to. It's it's a different different market. So um, it's not a big order, but shit, I need to add on to it. And of course, we've had endlers. Hardly sold them many, and then we sell some. We don't hardly have any left, so I don't have too much guppies. People kind of quit asking for guppies lately, but um, I gotta see if I could add on to this. I gotta remember today. Oh, my brain's gonna die. We're probably gonna get bit. We were slammed yesterday. First two, three hours. Then it died. And then, of course, the last half hour before close, 10 billion people come in, the whole herd of cattle. It's like, oh my gosh. And today's probably gonna be the same way. I think my. I'm so sore. Standing on this floor all day yesterday kills my back. Adam is unfortunately out sick. So I gotta use these rubber bands put on my uh, tendonitis. I have a belt on and then I have another belt but I think I'm gonna use a, a soft gun holster, pistol holster with a rock. I stick it where that cyanic nerve. Cyanic hasn't kicked in really. It just sore there. It, gets, it doesn't tense up like when it's full blown cyanic. So, anyway, um, what was I going to say? All right. So, I think it comes in Tuesday. So, Wednesday. But, yeah, Adam's out sick. So, that's putting a crimp in my 
This whole week's been a freaking shit show. Um, I'm so behind on so much stuff. Oh, it's crazy. Um, so, long fin lemon spots. But you got some in. So we'll have more coming in, I guess. More red bushy nose, black quarry cats, blue angels. They're usually the small size, said small on the list. Um, gold face cops, more of those Kugona, Kugunga, uh, reds, F1. Compress up, helianthus congos, more of the lupi. We're gonna have a lot of lupi. Uh, desert, more desert goby. So we're some of the stuff we have. I uh, just need to fill in the low spots. So red point Hondurans, which are I think we're almost out. Those last batch were really nice and they're big. So hopefully these come in nice. I maybe should order more marinades. Those are nice. The Get more of the Nanu Luteus, Nanu Luteus, whatever you want to call them. They're small, we have some, but that is a great fish. It's amazing. They don't look nothing right now like babies. Not super fast growers, they don't get big. They're a smaller Central American, not that aggressive. I have a pair that breeds over there in a 30 breeder, but they get nice, like yellow with black bands, a blue eye. They're in the same family, like, um, I don't know what the name is anymore. The convicts, the marinades, they're, um, not crypto hero, what are they? Um, they changed the name so many times. I don't even remember now. I'm brain fried. Uh, hopefully some redhead tapajo geos, which has been a challenge to get lately. The one supplier just sucks. A lot of the suppliers suck. I know someone might watch this, but being honest, I'm not lying. Uh, bad fish, don't get fish, wrong fish, different fish, um, and it's too damn expensive. Uh, Severums, gonna have a bunch of small Severums. Last batch came in good size. I'm hoping they're bigger. Sometimes, I don't know. It's what it is. So it's whatever is available you get is what you get. So red gold, blue sabrams, these Brazilian blues. I can't tell you the name. Those rainbow ones with the IW something. I didn't write the name down. It's something stupid I can't even pronounce. Um, and some tiger sabrams. I'm getting a handful of dovey eye they have. I don't know why, but I said that the other day. Screw getting a prana. Red belly pranas are boring. Get a dovey eye, like Karen over there. She's a bitch. You want an entertaining, aggressive fish that will, teeth will hit the glass? Get a dovey eye wolf cichlid. Or get the monoguents, red tigers we got down there. They get beautiful and big and mean. Pranas are boring. Um, I mean, they're cool. I have them. I've had pranas pretty much all my life. Uh, what else? Oh, some more of those albino Oscars. They were dang gone cute. I took like five to the hatchery. I don't know why, but like I need more to take care of. Uh, some Plecos, 201s, 128s, 240s, those extra large ones, and 190s. More Pygmy Quarries, more out of Slinkus, which we're low on. We still have enough right now, but those are popular sellers. I ordered 100. More Green Neons. I'm probably going to add Cardinal Tetras, and it looks like I'm going to add some Endler live bears on there so yeah fill in spots anyway let's go look around we got 12 people on good grief holiday weekend oh that's the thing you gotta hit it twice here no nope, maybe three times yep bingo so chaos lots of fish lots of tetras i got there's always some kind of sale these need to go. I really could use that tank. Two bucks a piece, the regular fifteen dollars a piece. They're they're cool, aggressive eaters. They're descalers, but they'll eat like small pellets. They eat those wiggler things. They love brine, bloodworms, and all that stuff. They get I don't know three, four inches, maybe five. The glass um, headstanders. Uh, plants. Uh, I don't know. I wanted to get an order in yesterday, but. 
I usually have Adam go through the list. I usually let him handle the plant order now, but he's been out, so um, I'll have to figure out myself. Fill in the gaps. We still have plants, but actually maybe I'll put the plants on sale. Yep, plants are going on sale, what we have, so we can move out. Well, these are nice. And I love those um, melon type swords. Those lots, yep. The red, and I love those. Uh, that's I love those bulbs. I put some in my MOBA tank, the 155 bone home. They destroyed them. I mean, the, the thing is still there, but I can't believe they ripped the plants apart. Angels, black ghost, some big bushy nose. Um, we're definitely low on small angels, but we got these medium large ones, which we sold a bunch of those. Those went really well. Cray Cray's. I think there's one fire eel left. Yep. Yeah. First Longford Tetris had so many. So the Dwarf Grammys, the Bartones are gone. Got the Peacock Bass. Yo-yos. These guys need to go. Gosh. The avocado Puffers. All four for 110 bucks. They're doing great. They chase each other around like crazy, but they're not killing each other. And they eat pellets. They eat, uh, obviously eat snails. They eat the trumpet snails. They can break the shells. So here, there's another great small Central Americans, the Sihikas. They're awesome. Another great little Central American. There's, um, I gotta bring the rest of the uh, blue lip, William's eyes. I have uh, another 20 probably left. And I want to sell the breeders, which no one seems interested in. Um, actually, African cichlid sales kind of just picked up lately. Um, well, we've had a lot of people coming back that's kind of been out of it or hasn't done anything. And uh, so I've seen some old customers I haven't seen for like five years. And uh, getting bit by the bug again. These are blue neon fluorescents that came in the other day. Oh, these um, red top albino zebras. That female's got a big mouthful. There's uh, intermediates. There's two males, or oh, three males. That sold one yesterday. These are really nice. Red tail shark got beat up. This is a, something new. It's an OB Borlei. Pretty wild. I mean, they're they're cool. Peacocks. Uh, the red empress. Somebody wants that big one. I got like three different sizes red empress. It's weird. Actually, that one might be a Taiwan reef. It was labeled. I don't know why, but they, you know, they get what they get, send you. Um, there's two Taiwani reefs down there, but I'm not sure. Big Z rocks. Still have those pim cats. Buy one, get one free. The big trout male I brought from the hatchery. It's probably 10 inches, maybe. Oh, the bino. Eurekas and then some medium mori eyes. Those are new. Three, three and a half inches. So, all these rad OB zebras are so nice. Dark. Red. That's when you get sunlight that helps. And some little ones. Then the yellow labs, this, this, that. Oh, the Madoka white lips males. <laughs> they are so small. I called them up on that one. I'm like, hey. Those are freaking, I'm selling for less. They're supposed to be, you know, I paid what I paid for those bigs, you know, the big halves and peacocks. So I'm not selling as much because I just, I think they're too, they're too small. So unfortunately, but you don't see males for sale often. I've brought in a couple here and there when out of the group because I had a heavy males. These guys are nice. Azurus, Electro Blue Twos, the Bino Sunshines. Love Dovi Eye. Hey, George. Yeah, the Flower Horns is a fun fish, too. You know, I say that's better than a piranha. These are the loop eyes I got. This is, um, they're a light yellow. The other batch is usually on the orange side, so a different color there's different phases of yellow the loop eyes yellows there's orange there's like almost red so 
that's the strain and there's varied sizes two inch to two and a half inch or bigger on some of them so they're probably a couple different batches um, to fill the order you know they might have 12 of one to another um, there's some different tanks in there Bottle of Simless the great gold ocelotus pearly ocelotus these came in nice the red top uh, cuddle patatas they came in big if I know they were coming that big I would have bought more so oh I gotta price those um, Some of the best fritosas around. Bred by me. Bigger Mori eyes. Oh, the peacocks are gone. Females left. What are those? Oh, the Luandas. So that's only three Luanda females left, it looks like. All the male Luandas went. I'm going to have to get the one out of the Icola Fertosa tank. I got one big nail in there I'm going to bring in the cell. So, yep. Lots and lots of fish, daffodils. They're big. They're bigger than what I thought they were going to be when they came in. And they were roughing each other up. One somewhere getting rehabbed if it made it. They tore one up pretty good. These guys, I'm surprised they're still here. The Gobies, the Congo Blue Spot, Aeromotus. Oh, these guys, the hot Nicholas eyes. Amazing, beautiful color. Males, obviously the real colorful and the females are just a, a goldish silver with a barring, smaller. They're a mouth brooder, West African. Oh, we got one with a tail. We gotta pull him out, rehab him. <laughs> they're they're very uh, coast species aggressive, obviously. Oh, look at her doing a dance. Actually, she looks like she might be holding. I wanted to keep some from the last batch, and I didn't. They sold so fast, so I did say they they got more babies growing out. So I might try to not do any more orders for a little while. Try to you know clear out tanks get some sales in and um, recoup and um, expecting you know it's been kind of the slow side so and usually spring summer it slows so I still haven't taken my sand tiger loaches I need to put those in the 265 oh there's still some guppies those sand uh, big ear guppies those came in we lost a bunch of them in the beginning but now what's left is good looks like it's almost all females oh there's a male yeah those weren't as uh not as great as i thought they were going to be and they were expensive so i uh, like getting stuff imported anymore is just a freaking joke at florida unfortunately i'm negative but i'm pretty much honest so getting good fish is a freaking challenge there's so much shit fish out in the world um, some of these outfits just don't give two shits um, they just want to pump them breed the shit out of them like like a puppy mill basically fish mills that just and they shit just ship shit fish um, the quality of fish is, is uh, a, a challenge. So, people are lucky to... Good morning, Canisto. Um, you know, people, I say, I'm, I'm bragging rights. Uh, lucky to have somebody like me because, um, you know, I'm not going to sell something that's uh, no good or sick or whatever. Not not knowingly um that's for sure this tank is a wreck that eel just freaking then he goes sits in that pipe he'll wreck the tank we're not here shit's all over the place i'm gonna have to freaking need to cement it so what time is it holy crap i'm gonna have to get going here gotta get maintenance started uh blow out those midas red devils sale 
Need the big fire eel needs a home. Somebody get that big fire eel. So, what else? Um, I'm working on dry goods orders. Oh, I just did a Oase, a Was, whatever. So we got some more canister filters coming. And I'm trying out some of their other products to see how they do. Um, super deal on the title filters. The 110s are all sold out. That's it. I'm not getting any more. Don't plan on it. So we have the 75s. So uh, it's super cheap. Um, this deal, redealed. So 615. The, the whole setup, not including before I had it and I was throwing in a bunch of freebies. If you want all that stuff, you could buy it. It's 30% off the air pump. Um, but the top tank stand filter, um, it's super, nobody's cheaper. If they are, they're losing money. <laughs> um, I still got to turn on the lights. What else? Oh, we're getting low on some of the uh, gravel backs. Oh, 30% off on the uh, Fluvals stuff. Waste control, quick clear, and what the hell is that? Grow plus. I was like, groat? Groot? Um, what else? That light's on a timer. Oh, some people are coming in for plants. Um, that was live plants when I did the thing Tuesday. It was uh, the marina. These plants, packs, 30% off, and those ones up there. So the plastic plants, marinas are 30% off. I'm going to do a sale on the live plants, uh, probably the 20% off. Um, just uh, get them out so we can get the new batch of stuff in. Uh, a bunch of tank kits. So some foods are on sale, some are on clearance, those bug bites. Um, all the API on sale. Specs, flex, kits, fluoride sand, 60 breeder. We got a 40 breeder used and a 30 breeder. Need those out of here. Uh, 55 set up. Someone's, we sold the other tank, so I just got another tank uh, in place. So I got to reprice that. That reptile cage needs to go. Yeah, Brian. <laughs> the nickel size are being sold as pairs. Yes. Sorry, I'm going back. I had to scroll back and catch. There's Karen. She's being a bitch. Her tube's down, so she went to lay eggs. Wrecking the tank. Look at this bitch. Ow! Oh, gosh! Unbelievable. Prinas don't do that. Trust me. That bitch does. Get a dovey eye. Or a flower horn. I don't do flower horns hardly. So, all these kits. Here. I don't think people do like discounts. They don't, they can't figure it out. They can't use your phone to do the discount. So here, I just did a, even a better deal. Um, these are regular $210, so that's 70 That's $80 off the 15-gallon kits. It's stupid cheap. So, but I got a bunch of them. The Flex, this is dumb cheap. Uh, $450. Bucks. The tank, kit, the 32 with the stand. The tank alone is usually about $400. It's supposed to be retail about $500 for that map whatever pricing or something so this tank's getting a little kind probably gonna need a water change man these red tigers have it they get big showing some red got that green emerald head but he's not turning like red red yet chocolate cichlids looking good i'm trying to get more chocolate cichlids in trying to get tiger dollars again the suppliers just suck they they put all this shit on the list but half time they don't even have it. They just keep regurgitating um, the same old list, and, you, and you're you're basing your orders on certain fish. Like I've said, uh, 
a thousand times. A lot of times when I order stuff, I'm not ordering everything because I want it or somebody wants it or I need it. It's ordering exactly like certain stuff that is really wanted or we really need and everything else is fluff. <laughs> it's just fillers to get a minimum order and make it worthwhile to ship it in. So, anyway. What else? Anything else? I'm losing my mind. Oh, uh, yeah, we'll be closed the 8th. We're planning on opening Sunday the 7th, which will be next Sunday, 11 to 3. That's the first Sunday I've been open in a long time. So, we'll probably do some kind of special. I don't know what it is. I haven't really thought about it. I already got freaking stupid specials off the yin-yang now. But um, I'll try to come up with something. Make it worthwhile to come and visit us and buy something, something. Um, so, yeah. Next Monday, we closed. Nobody. I'm closing the dojo. Everything's closed. Even the library's like closed. It's Everybody's freaking out. So, I don't know. Weird shit. So, whatever. Uh, another day. Um, so, I'll have Monday off, kind of. Well, I still have to work. I still have to come in and take care of the livestock, fish, and stuff. So, maybe I'll get some extra work done. I've been losing four days this week of work. So, um, what else? Yeah, Sunday open, 11 to 3. The 7th. All right, um, new fish order on Tuesday. Live plants, I don't know. Unless I get it sent in, and I might be able to get it by Thursday, Friday. Um, but I'm gonna have to work on that. So, um, that's it. So, all right, gotta go. We gotta get these tanks prepped and ready for opening and get the store ready. I gotta run and go take care of everything and haul ass back here and open the store. So I'll be here all day. So you want to see my ugly mug, other than and live, <laughs> other than this live, I'll be working the store. I normally not here. It's so many, so many people coming here. Like, you're not Adam. <laughs> Adam's usually always here. Um, I'm not. I'm here in the mornings, uh, the days, Tuesdays, Sundays, in between, running around, maintenance, and working in other buildings, working on the other business. And then I got the dojo in the evening. So I sorry, a lot of people were pulling up on Thursday. I had to close early. There's no one here to run the store. So, uh, and I got kids and gonna be waiting for class karate. So I, I'm not gonna do, I don't know. And I have so much shit going on. It's, it's, it's ridiculous. Um, I got some extra maintenance. I have an ex bronze player who need me to do a 600 gallon tank. I didn't get back to him yet. Um, it's getting close to get my custom tank in, that $14,000 tank that I gotta do. I got a meeting out there Wednesday. They wanted me to come. I was gonna come, I was gonna, I told them I was gonna come yesterday, Friday, but obviously that couldn't happen. Um, so now I gotta squeeze it in on Wednesday while I'm out in Eastside doing maintenance. So a lot of my plate, I need to talk to the builder, something else. I got another guy who wants, for toasters to ship to him in South Carolina, so I gotta try to figure, get him a list put together. I don't know, I'm losing my freaking mind. But, all right, I gotta go. Thanks for hanging out. Same bullshit, everybody says on YouTube, like, subscribe, share, blah, 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 blah. Hit the bell, ding, 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 whatever. <laughs> whatever, go with the flow. But, uh, yeah, I should, uh, well, Tuesday, I should be on in the morning. I won't have a fish yet till in the afternoon, I think. If everything's all right, and this weather doesn't mess shit up. So, I'll find out Monday. So, and uh, that's that. All right, y'all take care. Have a good weekend. Have a um, happy uh, Easter day. Um... I won't, it's going to be, I got to work, I got to stay at my mom's, which means zero sleep tonight, so she don't, make sure she don't fall, my sister can't stay tonight, so, my sister's back, we've been living there, and uh, so she fell like a week and a half ago, I go back to the emergency room, so, 
Yep, I gotta stay up and make sure she's all right. Ugh. So, it's gonna be a long 24 hours. But, y'all take care. I appreciate you. Thanks. I'm out. Bye bye. Get that X.